Okay, so what are three liver directed therapies that we should be considering for our patients with metastatic colorectal cancer with metastases to the liver? Okay, the top three. Number one, obviously, surgical resection is the gold standard for the treatment of tumors in the liver uh, when it's metastatic disease from colorectal cancer. You know, certainly surgical resection is truly dependent on the sheer number of lesions present, the location of where those tumors are, and the general health of the liver. But if tumors can be resected, this presents a potentially curative option for our patients with colorectal cancer with liver metastatic disease where there's only disease in the liver. Now, I also want to include that this modality, surgery, now also includes possible liver transplantation. Obviously, this is in a very selected population that is responsive to frontline therapy for patients with metastatic colorectal cancer, but liver transplant should be considered as well. Number two, ablation and radiofrequency uh, ablation as well as uh, radioembolization. Now, these liver-directed therapies can be considered in patients where surgical resection may not be an option, or if there's just a solitary small liver tumor that's amenable to ablation. Because when you look at some of the data, ablation for some of these small tumors, actually the outcomes seem fairly similar to surgery. Radioembolization or yttrium 90 or Y90, they can be considered uh, for select patients with metastatic colorectal cancer. There is some negative data in the frontline setting, so we really utilize Y90 uh, in specific patient situations, but we don't necessarily use it for everybody. And then finally, Hepatic arterial infusion pumps, or HAI pumps, these are done at uh, select centers across the country, and they really are for specific patients that have liver metastatic disease that are, is usually surgically unresectable. Hepatic arterial infusion pumps uh, deliver chemotherapy essentially at high doses directly into the liver, and this can sometimes induce disease stability. Sometimes you can get responses with HAI pumps that may lead to surgical resection in the future, uh, but certainly this is also a therapy that can be considered for select patients with liver metastatic disease.